Hello everyone and welcome to Saturday Morning RPG. Guys, this is a game that one of my friends just said you should play this and do a let's play of and I was like, okay, let's do it. Okay. The style of this game is absolutely awesome, I'm not gonna lie. It's like this comic book action, old action, cool game. I mean, it really is. It's awesome. It's just a fun game to play. Um, I, don't, I, I played a video, I played a game of it, and just to try it out, and I was like, let's do it. Let's do this, guys. So I'm actually going to delete this file right here and jump right into it. Um, so let's do this, guys. This is actually a really cool game. Episode 1, Dream of Destiny. Let's do this. Alright, so I hope all the audio was good. The guy's sleeping right there. Can, announcer said, Can manly man stop Commander Hood's hinuous plans? Find out after these messages from our sponsors. <laughs> yes. Yes, uh, yeah, this game really is awesome. So here we go. Let's do this. Now this right here is Commander Hood. You're too late, Marty. Samantha, the one you love, will soon be mine. There's nothing you can do to stop me. You're wrong. You're a bad guy, and bad guys never win. Our player is Marty. Mwahaha. Your hopeless confidence and optimism amuses me. But enough talk. Have at you. So here we go, guys. The game itself, the combat, is a turn-based system. There'll be a lot more in a second. This right here is just like this, you know, little intro thing. So you click on this one you want to attack to, and you try to get in the blue for like an extra, like a critical attack. There we go. So we got him down. Some good amount of health. Seriously, that's the best you've got. You're not even worth the time to take on and to crush you myself. So he's going to disappear, teach his little pest a lesson, and his goons would come out. He has a wedding to plan. Let's take this guy. Oh, oh, he just owned me. Oh my goodness, he just owned me. Bad guys never win. What a choke. Get lost, nerd. Or we'll grind you into the dust again. <laughs> guys, do you hear this soundtrack? It is really amazing. I'm not gonna lie. Dude, that was so not cool. Mystery guy appears. The wizard. Yeah, they schooled you. Of course, you're pretty dumb to take on Commander Hood unarmed. He's the baddest bad guy around, but he kidnaps Samantha and plans to make her marry him. I couldn't just stand there. If you're going to take on Commander Hood, you're going to need some help. I am the wizard, and I'm here to grant you an ancient power. Whoa, what is that? And light beams fly down. Keep it down. Doing this takes a lot of concentration. Blue book appears with amazing 3D effects. <laughs> Take this artifact, Marty. It will give you the power you need to destroy Commander Hood and save Samantha. Hmm, this is a notebook. Yes, yeah, a notebook of ancient power. Of course it is. It looks like it because it got the scribbles in front. With it, you can use word items to f you find in the world as powerful weapons. Anything this notebook touches will be affected by its magic. How can this possibly? How is this possible? There is no such thing as a magical notebook. Fine, you don't have to believe me. See for yourself. Hey guys, did you hear of what this jerk has to say about your mothers? <laughs> oh man. What? Our mother was a saint. Or his mother was. Oh, man. Hold on a minute. I didn't say anything. Oh, man. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I told you guys. This game really is awesome. Um, let's do this. Oh, so the, whenever you start a match, you have to do this. Scratch them off. Each one you get, you get a bonus. Oh, I missed one. As you can tell, this is no ordinary notebook. The stickers you scratch gives you powerful boosts in battle. In addition, your notebook can store objects that can pummel your enemies. Just defeat these guys by using those objects. So guys, you have three different things. This third thing you're going to get to in a second. So I can choose any one of these 
items and it will do a different thing and this ain't nothing this is only like not even a quarter of what all the items are in the game there's some that's amazingly cool so let's take this guy on oh i missed the block there we go i block it that time so i'm doing moonwalk back air punch the guy in amazing fashion and he's now paralyzed i'm actually gonna do this well he's not paralyzed just yet i'll do this boom righteous eight Eight attack that is absolutely amazing I'm gonna do it once more try to take him out okay let's see if I can get another red go on that yes I can and he just got obliterated and I got a rank B which is pretty good I like that everything was pretty high up there Marty oh man you knocked out my buddy the hood shoulder sheds time to die for the good of the hood wonder how long it took him to make that one up I don't know but I would like to know. I really would. So you gotta scratch these off at the beginning of every level. There's some that's almost impossible to scratch off. Like right there, I missed a lot. I've unlocked the full range of abilities held by your notebook, Marty. Now you're playing with power. In addition to using objects to attack, you can generate power from batteries that build up the charge that will boost the effect of those attack. Charges uses up your magical power. Magic can be restored through defending against attacks or punching enemies. So this is where the battery comes in. Each one of these batteries has a different effect. This is like a rapid click. This is just a one time thing. And this is like this boom, boom. Like I get to click, but it gives you much greater effect. Um, so I'm just gonna do the basic right now. And let's do it again. We just gotta click super fast. Ah, oh, that's pretty good. We got half weight. And our multiplayer went up, so that is our damage boost. So I'm going to do the um, symbol. I'll get into the rest of them later. I just want to finish this little tutorial area. Boom, look at that. 21 damage. Um, I'm actually going to do something cooler. I'm going to do the candy bar. The fast, weak, multi-hit attack. Are you ready for this, guys? So i got to do X, C, V. Uh, see, I missed one. Uh, one, guys. One is all I needed. So you can see there's tons and they're really cool guys. That is really, that's nothing. Some of them are just amazing. Um, I only got a C rank that time. I got 27 experience points, not enough for a level almost halfway and I got $3. Hey, you know, what What can you do? That's what you can do. That was radical. <laughs> I told you, but don't get cocky, kid. You can still travel to the, you, have, you still have to travel to the swords far side of Gaia. If you want to rescue Samantha, that won't be easy. Commander Hood's goons, Skelbor, and Madeline are waiting. They'll do anything they can do to stop you. With this power, I feel ready to take on the world. I love this power. It's so bad. <laughs> and there he goes. Oh man, I like that guy. He's pretty cool. So here we go, guys. This is like this is where you move around. You use WSD keys. I know it doesn't look like like the amazing next gen graphics <laughs> but it, this is a fun game the style of it is awesome so these things right here these are vending machines you go in and you can stock up on different powers and buy new powers if you have enough money so um, before we actually start up all the areas there's a notebook in the top right hand corner if I'm going to click this it will open up this amazing cool thing um, which you can change your stickers your notebook and your cover I'm actually going to change the co cover to something that gives me two plus strength and it is of a tiger which looks epic I'm not gonna lie and I'm gonna change my stickers if I've got any stickers left I do so um let's look at this I actually want to put the orange up front actually let me put them down here what does the cake do health five I don't need that um that's actually pretty good Okay, so once that's done, I'm going to go to the final thing, guys, and show you this. This is your health. This is where you find out how much experience you need, your stats, and this is where your different items. I'm actually going to change the bear out for the candy bar, because the candy bar just ain't that good, in my opinion. It doesn't do enough. And you have your quest and the magic cave. Ooh. So um, let's just do this, guys. Let's jump right into this. So... I press spacebar, I can drive a <laughs> a skateboard around. So let's take on this guy. Alright. Lizard Man 1.2. 1.0. 1 
Ah, oh, missed it, man. All right, so let me um. Oh, really? I was really clicking it, man. So this lizard guy, I'm actually gonna use the bear arm because I haven't used it yet. All right, not bad. So let's see what I have to do to this. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> that was amazing. Rank A. I cannot believe that that thing killed him that easy. I'm not, guys, I'm not joking. Who's this guy? This is an angry jerk. They don't call me angry jerk for nothing. Muncher. <laughs> wow. What's up back there? I see something back there. A package you see it up there. So I'm actually going to use that bear again. Ah, oh, man, I keep missing it. Okay. okay. Let's block against this and him. All right. So let's do this. So let's use this. Now what I like about it is I don't have to like wait to get it between the blue marks or wrap it. They click it. It just goes. Oh, so I guess if you do like a certain attack, it will make it better. I guess that's what I'm thinking. So if we, I guess if we get a critical somehow, it'll be more um, power. So the cookie will gain you health. The basketball will give a burn effect, which I would do on this guy over there. He's gonna do it four more times. Why not? I might actually add a cookie next time. One damage, not a lot at all, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna attack this guy now because he has burn on him. Oh man, I may have to eat a cookie next time. I think I will. So let me eat a cookie. <laughs> Look at that big cookie. Oh man. Okay, so um, let's do this on this guy. Or this guy. There we go. I missed him, so I guess it's a very low accuracy rating for it. That's what I'm getting at. Or I'm hinting what it's hinting at, so okay, that's pretty. Has it made Oh! Oh man, he just got owned. Rank C, not best. I got a rank A. That was amazing to get that. So let's open this package up and see what it is. 25 XP. Not bad. What did I get out of that? I don't know what I got, but I got something. Oh, it's we found it, guys. Madeline. What is this? How could a puny worm like you make it past my lizard minions? Aren't you mad, Madeline? <laughs> Who am I, Madeline? Of course, you sim feeble minded simpleton. How could and you should cower in fear? I am the most powerful of them all. Powerful, yeah, right. This cool cat, the wizard, gave me this nifty notebook. I'm going to wipe the floor of you. Insolent insect. You will regret those words where you stand. Right there. <laughs> you will never make it to Commander Hood, for you will fall at my hands. Oh, I love the music. Man, I want the soundtrack. I can never get three. Man, I don't know how quick you gotta be. So I'm gonna show you the second one, guys. This is C. It gives me, like, down to 68. So C, C is tough. This um, I'm gonna show you the third one right away. It is this one. So I'm gonna boom, 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 boom. There we go. See how it is. Achievement unlocked. Use all three charging methods. So right here, I'm actually going to use my symbol because it deals like a lot of damage. So let's see if I can get the radical on it. Yes, I did 62 damage. Wow, that was pretty. That was cool. Oh, he switched to me. So that was amazing. I can't believe I did 62 damage. That was pretty nifty. Um, I'm going to use the try to get a burn effect on her also. Nice, okay. Not a lot of damage done. So I'm just going to keep doing this one. I'm going to do it one more. Just to get my... Nice, okay. 3.1, not bad. Look at this ability. That's so cool. That is really cool. So let me try this once more at the teddy bear. Oh, nice. 
Okay. So, um, let's just do it once more. Not bad, not bad. Do it once more. Oh, he's using a teddy bear on me now. But what I do with the first one, that was a that was pretty cool what I did. Let's use a basic attack to save my other um bonuses. Man, he did a lot of damage. I like that pencil thing, yeah, it's pretty nifty. Okay, I'm gonna use the um, no I don't use a teddy bear, I was trying to use the basketball, but that's alright. He's like a mini boss anyways. I love the art style game. I don't keep saying that, but I really do. I love this type of game. It's just fun, you know? It's not like just it's fun. Okay. Alright, this should take her on, and yes it does. Rank C. That was awful. That really was. And I leveled up. Oh, nice. And I gained 11 health. Pick a trait to increase. I'm going to increase strength. Because that's like the main thing. Which I want to do. Very good guys. Very good. Awesome. We just took out Madeline. So let's um. Let's go up here. And let's see what this. Oh I just bypassed that guy completely. What is this? A snide jerk. What are you looking at? Huh? Oh I can't get by him. I was trying to get by him. Oh three of them. Oh, man, I cannot do it, man. Okay, so what I want to do is... Okay, I got 67, not bad. Could just use a simple one and not have to click all the time. Okay, so let's do this. Let's try to take him out pretty quick. So since I increased my damage, I just got 34. That's pretty, that's pretty decent. I'm going to use a burn effect on both of these. And um, see if I could take him out in just a couple turns. I should be able to. Because they only have 25 health. Uh, this should be very easy. I <laughs> do the moonwalk back here. And just punch him. Oh man, that was, that was, that's awesome. Um, oh, let's see. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do. I'm just going to keep doing this. Oh, he's down. He's down for the count. So let's see if we can map it up. Pop it up, I mean. Nope, cannot. Man. Alright, so I'm just going to do the, the teddy bear of the rainbowness. Let's see if we take him out. Yo, we did a super one. That's, that's cool. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. He just explodes into a million pieces. That's pretty cool. And I leveled up again. Awesome. Um, strength or magic? I'm actually going to do magic. Because I want to um, upgrade that a little bit. Wow, we just took him out, man. Alright, what is this? A sword. Let's click on this. Marty added a sword of unknowns to his inventory. Oh, let's, let's check that out real quick. So, V. So, inventory. Oh, it's a new ability. Oh, what, what should I um, take away for this? I, ooh, I really don't know. I wish I could have two. This is good, but I want to see how much this does first. I'm going to actually take it out for the lesser disc. I know it's weird, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. Or should I? I'm actually, ah, I want the teddy bear. I'm going to try the teddy bear out. But I want to see what the sword does. So I'm going to save the game. And everyone, I am actually going to end this video right here. We defeated Madeline. We figured out a little bit of the game. Um, we got some new abilities. We leveled up twice in this quick in this video. That's pretty nifty. I like that. Um, I hope everyone is enjoying it. I really, I'm, I'm liking the game. It's pretty fun. Um, if you enjoying the videos, leave a like down below. Um, subscribe for more. To stay tuned for the next video. And um, everyone, this has been Two by Two Gaming. And take take care, guys.